You can already read it in the title. Let's check out the October earnings of Amazon Merch. You already know how the game is played. First of all, we have a look at the 2022 numbers so we can, can compare it to this year. If you want to see also our monthly sales and you're also interested in daily sales updates in our story, then join us on instagram.com slash flying research. Leave us a follow and then you get daily updates. And now we jump into October of 2022. And this was the exceptional month of 2022 with nearly 2000 net sales. We had 8,400 euro in income and an ad spend of 3,500 euro. And you can also see here that the German market was standing out last year. Great sales, great revenue. And also when you see it compared to the ad spend and the acres that this was really, really great. And now we jump into this year, into 2023, and then you can see that we increased a lot in sales to 2,866 net sales. When you take, uh, take the gross sales you have, we have over 3,000 and also a five figure income this month with 10,500 euro in earnings in revenue and also a very high ad spend that's the that's the downside here with 5,900 euro and because of this high ad spend we have in the end even lower net earnings with 4,600 and a few euros compared to last year where we had a little bit more, but you see this in a moment. You will see also here, I can go back, that the German marketplace that was so exceptional in 2022 did not perform in the same way like it did last year. USA ramped up, but we also advertised a lot there and yeah, the other marketplaces are a little bit up, a little bit down, but yeah, stayed relatively even, I think, except, uh, okay, you can't see it here, the, um, you can see it here from the, from the sales numbers that also the Spanish marketplace was not as good as it was here last year. But to the reasons for that, I go to in a moment. Um, from the design side, you can see that especially Halloween has driven the sales a lot. And yeah, of course, USA, then a lot of USA, then uh, designed for Germany. And then you can yeah see a mix from Spanish, German, Italian designs and so on. But this is all Halloween related or nearly all Halloween related. One design is... <laughs> A birthday design from 1989 and this was targeting and ranking I saw it in the ads for Taylor Swift and this was also why we had a lot of sales for this one design it had nothing to do no reference or anything simply a birthday design with this year and yeah there were a few few days where this was totally ramping up and 20 or 30 sales a day um, yeah but this trend is also now over and yeah we take it so most of this is Halloween related and now the comparison from also sales organic sales and so on we go to now and then I also explain a little bit the reasons why this month was good very good but we're still a little bit disappointed so here you have the direct comparison from October 2022 to 23 we already talked about the royalties ads and the profit and then we go right to the organic sales that were a lot better than last year this is very positive news also for next year already through ad sales we made 1034 sales last year and this year we made over 1600 but of course you can argue that this number was driven through the ads the extra ads we we did this year compared to last year the part of the ad sales from the net sales so we made nearly 52 percent through ads this year and uh, sorry last year in 2022 
and this year we made nearly 57 percent and this number from last year is a lot higher compared to the other months of 2022 and also last year the net margin per sale was exceptional with four euros and 22 cents and also three euro and 40 cents were just spent per ad sale this means with every ad sale we made we still made a profit of 82 cents and this is also the main reason when you compare it to 2023 why we have net earnings even more profit than last year it was because of that when you just see this number you would even say that probably the profit bear even higher or a lot higher compared to last year but it was not exactly that way because also the organic sales for this year ramped up so this is probably the most positive note from last year october to this year october that the at the organic sales are a lot better and return rate okay last year you have to say good this year because 2023 has in general uh lot higher return rate and yeah this was a direct direct comparison from october and then we have now a look at the comparison of the whole year 2022 to 2023 and here you can now see 2022 to 2023 after october you can see here the royalties the ads the profits everything a lot higher but you also have to say that the development slowed down especially in this month because the profit was less than last year so the royalties are up 62 percent overall over the whole year 77 percent more ad costs and the profit is up around 50 percent to be honest i thought um, that this numbers will be higher in october um, but there were there were a few reasons why the october did not exactly perform like we wanted the main reason is probably that the traffic were simply not there we checked our sellers regularly also in incognito browser so now no cookie history or similar like that and our positioning were good we checked through flying research our best seller ranks the best seller ranks were fine for the keywords we should rank for the positioning was very good i would uh, say probably a lot better than 2022 but but what i realized or what we realized after a while is that it goes slowly up and the september was also better than last year so preparation was good october was also fine the start but the peak sales were not there so last year we had days five six seven in a row where we made like 140 sales 50 sales and then steadily 150 sales over three and four days and then we still made 120 110 and so on and this year it was a lot more yeah waving is this an english word i don't know but you know what i mean um in waves we had like a day with 160 sales so a new record in sales and then the next day we had just 120 sales and then we had up 150 sales again and then we had 110 sales and yeah this this is the main reason that this peak was not there so the base was good the basic sales we made in a day that was not hype not a lot of traffic or anything the days are good better than last year but when it comes to the peak it was worse than last year of course due to inflation um economical situation and so on it has a lot of reasons probably and also the traffic on google was not there maybe this topic was not as interesting halloween as last year i don't know but yeah this was the main reason we had another very stupid reason to be honest we changed the pricing on our german bestseller and then we saw a sudden drop in sales and we also could not do anything because it was still processing on and on the german marketplace the price was simply not there so nobody could buy we messaged the amazon support but it took three days till the system 
got the design in the timeout and when it was timed out we were able to increase or decrease the price a little bit send it to processing again and then it was live again with the price and yeah when the price was there of course also the sales were coming up and this was the yeah, very hot phase of this year already and yeah there were like two and a half or three days that are missing from these sales so it could be better but yeah this was a technical problem from amazon side that was very very costly for us i mean it can happen it should not happen and probably for next year we will set our final prices a little bit earlier so may we maybe make a little bit less sales in the early stages of halloween but in the end that the most important is that it should run so the two main reasons or the main reason is the peak in sales that was not there like in 2022 and also some technical difficulties after all the organic sales are still okay ad sales are also up a lot compared to last year and yeah i mean you can see it in the statistics here overall the statistics are quite well compared to last year i'm also very interested how november and december with the christmas time is going and if we see something similar from peak sales or if it is maybe a little bit better so yeah this is our amazon merch till now for 2023 i just filmed the german version of this video and yeah i came to the conclusion that it can't always go up of course the earnings are higher we earned over 10,000 euro this month but the ad spend was also very high and the profit is even a little bit less than last year and this is of course disappointing i also know this is complaining on a very high level but yeah everybody has their goals and we prepared everything in september in august for this october and it didn't work out quite the way we want but we learn from it we have to work harder we also make smaller choices for next year and then we hope that next year we get the numbers that we want and when i am already at this topic i also want to give you the following message because it always makes me angry when i see something like this when you see a thumbnail or a video where someone explains again how he makes fifteen thousand dollars last week with one design that is obvious the bestseller or one of the best sellers on amazon merch then simply don't believe this person also when you can see a profile on instagram where someone has standing hey i made 10 million with amazon merch or something like that then simply never trust these people as long as they don't post a long video where they update their browser where they can show different sites and so on because this is all fake here I have an example. I go to my screen here in Amazon Merch. Oh, I made 300 sales. And yeah, you can see here, this is the Merch page and everything is live and this is the browser. This is just manipulated from me. I mean, you can go here to the menu. Then you can get here the element that you want. You can see here 300. Then I type in here 1000. I click enter and then I have 1000 sales and it's still my browser. So never trust these people who just make a screenshot or something and then they want to sell you uh, a course or a tool or anything like that because this is yeah this is really scamming people because this is something these people never reached and they want to make profit and this is their profit you and not because they do it and not because they stay say the truth i have to say that because i see this since years since i'm here i see videos like that and it always makes me wrong uh yeah it is wrong and it always makes me angry because these are things and hopes people play with that are not correct thank you for hearing my opinion and thank you for watching this video i hope you liked it and if you do then please like this video and subscribe to this channel of course if you have any questions then just write it down in the comments and if you want to see now what is coming next to flying research and flying upload you can click here on the top left of your screen and then i see you in the next video